Hey, baby sunshine goddess through through how's your girl guys so i just here with like a quick message i was doing some um bible studying last night in the middle of the night i don't know like spirit has me up in the middle of the night doing a lot of learning a lot of teaching so um last night i was reading about israelite and jesus and moses and and jesus said to moses put a snake up and let the people get bit and you're like I know you guys like put a snake up. Thanks for being like, subscribing, and sharing. And when you get a chance, baby, hit that notification button down below so you're notified when I post my video. Sunday School with Sunshine Goddess Crew. I've been doing this, okay? So listen. So Spirit said to Moses, God said to Moses, put this, put the pole up and a, a bronze snake. And when anyone that walks by gets bit and they'll live forever. We need the snakes in our life. You know why? Because had we not get bitten, we wouldn't know what to look for. We wouldn't know the right and the wrong. We wouldn't know the path. We need people in our life to do us wrong. Because without those people doing us wrong, we won't know what to look for in our next enemy. We know we won't know the red flags. Yes, at the time it hurts when people betray us and they pretend to be our friends. They pretend to love us, even family members. You know what I'm saying? But once you're betrayed, you kind of know what to look for. It's kind of like without getting a bee sting, how would you know it hurt? You know what I'm saying? Because you're just going off of what someone else says. But when you go through the fire, when you go through the wilderness, when God delivers you out of all that, and with his promises that you'll come out of it, you know what I'm saying? Unscathed at that. You know what I'm saying? You'll be able to look at the face of your enemies that did you wrong and said, well, you bit me, but it didn't hurt. Sunshine Goddess Crew, I love you guys. One third, three o'clock. Because it's so important. We need the snakes in our life. We need people to betray us. We need to go through all that because that's part of the journey. You can't escape that. Without that, you're not going to get to where you are. Without spirit. And also, when you know someone's not for you, get them from around you. Why do we need to wait and see what's going to happen bad? If your intuition 111 is telling you that this person is not a good person, why would God tell you that? because he has nothing else to do god could forewarn you about a million things in life but when he first warn you about a person place situation job you know what i'm saying uh, uh, uh going somewhere and i don't think i don't if i feel it in my spirit you feel it in your spirit because that's what god's trying to send to you that like it's not a good to be a good idea the day i went to my motorcycle accident the first the day of my motorcycle accident i said to my friends i'm not gonna ride my bike i'm gonna drive my car had it, i drove my car maybe i not would have not gotten to uh, that motorcycle well i would have been in my car but who knows what else what happened but it's always go with your intuition about how you feel god gave us a spirit of sound mind and discernment not a spirit of fear and i think that's important that we use that energy energy if friends such a guys crew a little brief message for you because god puts the snakes in your life for a reason okay and then if they bite you you live on forever. Andrew, Andrew, Reze. Such a guy's crew, the mystery of the snakes, the snakes in our life. Why do we need the snakes in our life? Because they're there because once they bite us, we live forever. Such a guy's crew, I love you guys. Keep your head up, your head close, God. With Sunday school with such a goddess. I love you guys. Mwah.